Hey, this is Mariela from The Functional Company. All right, it's What in the World Wednesday. I'm gonna share a piece of news with you today. I just made that up, but I'm gonna share a piece of news with you today uh, that I find just to be uh, just mind-blowing, right? Where people's intentions and where their attention is. So this, I'm gonna put this article in the description, uh, in the like the link of this article in the, in the description in case you wanna read it completely. But here, I'm just gonna read to you. First, the title says, Big Pharma CEO, quote, we're in business of shareholder profit, not helping the sick. So this uh, was an interview uh, that was done uh, last July with a turning uh, pharmaceutical CEO, Martin uh, Shkreli. And so basically what happened is that he uh, changed, the, he raised the price from a newly acquired drug from $13.50 to $750. It's a huge difference, right? So he was being interviewed about this and uh, basically what he said in this interview with MSNBC, uh, he said his company's responsibility is uh, to the shareholders, not the customers who rely on his drugs to live. So why am I sharing this? First of all, obviously it's, it's a little bit shocking. The rest of it, like I said, I'm gonna leave it in the uh, description in case you wanna read it. But the reason that the functional coexists is because I don't think anybody should get to the point where you have to pay $750 for uh, something in order to live, for like a drug that you depend on to live, right? But we shouldn't even get to that point. We should be way back before anything gets really bad. We should just really keep maintenance on our body. And if we actually make a small investment every month into our own health by selecting better food, organic food, less sugar, uh, you know, some supplements, and it's a, an investment over time, we're helping the body to rebuild itself so that we can greatly reduce the chances that we're going to have to need or be at the, uh, you know, in the dependency of some kind of a drug like this. Um, and for some people, that is a lot of money. So $750 in the grand scheme of things, honestly, it's not a lot of money. Uh, but if you need, you know, 10 of those pills or you need 30 pills of those in a month and then in a year, etc., it ends up becoming a huge bill for a lot of people. And for just a fraction of that, if we make that investment on a daily, weekly, monthly basis through natural means, we can greatly avoid huge interventions, not just like something like this uh, with the pharmaceutical drug, but also uh, surgery, for example, or some big major intervention. What happens is usually we just don't really pay attention to our body as much. We're just like, it's fine. We haven't really learned too much about how to keep it well. And then at some point something goes terribly wrong and then suddenly we're shocked, right? And at that point, the intervention that you have to take is much more expensive, much more effort, much more time, just creates a lot more uh, chaos into somebody's life to have to handle it at that point. So my personal viewpoint is that if we get some information on how to actually just help our bodies throughout time, and we really just help to train our bodies, make it more efficient, optimize, you know, and help to optimize the immune system, uh, fat burning mechanisms, you know, brain, uh, mental focus, etc. All of these things are gonna pay off in the long run because the body is constantly gonna be detoxing and repairing itself, etc. So something like this is, is really incredible. You, you can see where some companies' intentions are. They're definitely not all the same. And you have to take each thing, each case as it is. But my own personal viewpoint is that it's definitely worth investing in your health on the daily for longevity, long-term health, and to prevent these crazy expenses later. Because sometimes people say, oh, that natural health care, that's too expensive. And I'm just like, compared to what? You know, you either want to pay it at the front end or you'll pay it at the back end. And when you pay it at the back end, it's not just money. It's time, effort, emotional hardship, and so many other things that go along with it, right? So a little bit of investing in the front end is going to pay off long term. All right. So thanks so much for tuning in. That's all I want to mention this time around. Share this information with somebody you think can benefit, and I will see you on the flip side. Hey, if you're liking the information on this channel, don't forget to subscribe, click the button and share this with your friends and family. We've got lots more information coming. Thanks so much for being here.